Mara, ha ha. Ooh. Mara, na ta. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> oh goodness. Okay. My, my brain is like totally in here are the something. ones i need repaired yep i might be able to do okay. the other one maybe okay hey so i can do the other one too expensive too expensive yeah you can't repair this <gasps> but i've repaired it before yeah, but it, it gets expensive it, every time. Yeah. Like at least every time. It does. At least you can't you can't repair it with a full ever uh, since one point eight diamond pick. Oh. Try with just single diamonds or something. Oh, oh, I don't have any diamonds on me. Oh, inner chest done. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, teach me how to Minecraft, Mara. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> so actually, yeah, doing a diamond you... doesn't work. No. No, it says it's too it. expensive. Then it. it's too expensive to repair at all. No, Whatever. silky. <laughs> now you gotta build a grave for it. That's what I do with all yeah, my Yeah, you desperate. can't even use one single diamond. I already have like four. <laughs> that are two I think you can repair them like maybe three or four times. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, thank you. There you go. Well, silky, this will be your last run. Oh, you've been a good pick. <laughs> Wait, can I have my diamonds back? <laughs> <laughs> I thought I gave them to you. Uh, they you. they swooped up. <laughs> oh, okay, there you go. You swiped them. <laughs> Thank I you. Them to you. <laughs> oh, oh, I no, don't know I what you're talking about. I, <laughs> I definitely <laughs> dropped those. Hush there. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry. Somewhere. Oh, hey, there's some in here. Yeah, and if you need torches, I can always light. trade for some diamonds. So. Oh, it's here. Words <laughs> thinking of me and loving, loving me tonight. Tonight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, five all goes west. Ah. <clears throat> all right, let's mine. <laughs> let's mine. I'm recording. Wait, are we? Oh, I've been girl. recording, girl. I've been recording this whole time, girl. Do you I even the, Minecraft? Who was it that got diamonds off their like first? Break. Well, last time April oh, well, did it, and then the time yeah, before that, that someone good. else did it. Oh my I'm calling hacks. I wish eggs still hit people. What do you They're mean? They're gonna hit again in one nine, so it kind of. Oh, will they? That. Do yes, they not hit they people right I now? I look forward to that. Hey guys. Hey what? We can each pick a cave and not even worry. I know. Well, There's probably. like no That's trolls so nice. today. <laughs> <laughs> no one is trolling. That you would. I want this. Oh, yeah, this one works. What are we talking about? Are we talking about oh. Favel Goes West? Well, we, we already did our <laughs> bit, I think. <laughs> we should pick a more relatable topic. <laughs> Favel um, Goes to Europe? There was a, <laughs> there was a straight to VHS <laughs> version, If they I made think. that, I would totally watch it in theaters. Not gonna lie. Yeah. <laughs> It'd be great. Oh, goodness. So, any topics for today? Anything exciting hmm. happening for you guys? Hmm. Exciting is pizza. relative. Okay, here's a topic. Is it Pizza's okay? Relative. Oh yeah, you had pizza. I think mm -hmm. we just talked pizza. about pizza. Pizza is oh, always gosh. relative. <laughs> we always talk Don't about talk about <laughs> food. I haven't eaten yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I made pancakes this morning pizza. and they were so good. Okay. I only had breakfast and that's been like 10 hours ago. What? Oh, I'm sorry, Fabe. Wow. I won't talk about pizza anymore. Don't starve yourself. Did I, did I mention take that take I care of your some body. pizza? Take care of your body. Yeah, pizza will take care of my body for sure. So, <laughs> uh, so right Fulton, you <laughs> said you had a topic, right? Yes. Yeah. So mm -hmm. uh, we can debate uh -oh. on whether I we hate think debates. No, this is a good one. Me too. Like this one. <laughs> <laughs> this is a good one. Is it dumb or uh, wrong? I guess would be the right word to have your Christmas decorations up already. Oh, great! We're talking about it's moral <laughs> conversation. Uh, interesting. Is it wrong to have your Christmas decorations? Okay, decoration? November. November is okay. I can see that, but all the shops have it in September, and that is not okay. Mm. Uh, right. They don't do I, that here. Cool I feel like they they come out as soon as uh, Halloween is over, mm -hmm. but that makes me feel bad for Thanksgiving. Right, because it's like who cares about being thankful? Well, and it's always been ironic to me that Christmas follows Thanksgiving. It's like let's let's take some time to think about what we're thankful for. Now, Christmas, give me all the things. Yeah. You know, like it's 
Now, yeah, now tell too. Santa what you want. You know, it's just. <laughs> That's enough it. being thankful. We're done. Yeah, we're, we're done. done here. Yeah. Black Friday, you know, like that whole thing. Ooh, I almost died. Um, when is Black Friday again? It's the day oh, after Thanksgiving, it. isn't it? Found a silver fish block. When is Thanksgiving again? It's like the third or fourth Thursday of November. Yeah. Is Black isn't okay. Black Friday the day after Thanksgiving? Yep. And that's like the saddest part. Every year, every year. Mm -hmm. On Black Friday, someone dies because they are literally trampled to <laughs> Sorry, death. That's not funny. <laughs> it's, I mean, it's not funny, but it's like, I'm it's terrible. absurd. It just blows my mind that we, the day after we're supposed to celebrate just being thankful and family and all that stuff. Yeah. Then we all, like, even that day, a lot of people go there and be there at midnight when the doors open, serious? they will be so die? driven. Yes, people get trampled to death when the doors open of the store because what? people are rushing in. Yeah, Because you're supposed to be able to get the it's best America, deals of the year. So a lot of people do it to save money on yeah. Christmas shopping. And they become murderers for that. Yes, but it's just yeah. insane <laughs> to me that All in the sake that, of is on, that that happens, you know, that that... Yeah. I don't know. We're yeah, just that so is very... insane that if it happens yeah, at crazy. all at any time. Yeah. It yeah. doesn't matter yeah. when. <laughs> yeah, it's true, yeah. but it, it's just... Yeah, I mean, it's it's shopping. It is shopping. And That's it's just like, sad that yeah. it happens. <gasps> you know, like, it's predictable yeah. now. Yeah. It's well, crazy guess, to me. Uh, people are going back to the Neanderthal days <laughs> and they have to hunt. <laughs> and it's dangerous to hunt. Well, they are hunting <laughs> for sales. That's on... true. <laughs> Yeah, there's always chaos on Black Friday, though. It's just kind of crazy to me. I, I only know uh, from Amazon. What That's is the this only... tunnel here? The big two-wide or three-wide tunnel? Yeah, it's bigger than... It's five-wide. Uh, yeah, I don't know yeah. who that is. I don't know what that was. It's interesting. This might be part of his, like... You know, sewer? the... Yeah, the sewers. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. That's Sorry, it's in... Random oh, by the way, sorry for being a killjoy. I just get really angry about Black Friday. So. <laughs> no, I think it's... I, I was talking to somebody about this the other day. Like, I think that our generation is going to start pushing against stuff like that. I hope so. Like, I've just seen so much, like, backlash from people our age and younger who are just fed up with, like, the consumerism yes. and just the constant yes. neediness mm. of American people. That's true. <laughs> and so, like, I think that, like... Even with technology, you know, you think about like Apple releases a new phone every year and if yeah. it weighs too much, too little or it doesn't have this feature, like we all just lose our crap and yep. just start like act like we're going to go like bomb Apple because they didn't do what we wanted. Yeah. And it's like, mm, what are yeah. we doing with our lives? It's true. Well, and even the <laughs> fact that we've done it so, for so long that the way that they make products is completely different now. They make it to mm -hmm. only last, you know, like a year right. or yeah. so. Yeah. Just... And that, that's what's frustrating to me. I was just thinking about this mm -hmm. yesterday, about how I really wish as a human species or humanity that we wouldn't make any crap project products, that everything yeah. was like, just imagine what the world would be like if we didn't make crap. <laughs> if we didn't make yeah. crap. <laughs> well, I think that's what like the whole like artisan kind of like hipster yeah. craftsman style stuff is like coming out of because it's like people are getting fed up of like mm -hmm. just, you know, conveyor belt manufacturing mm -hmm. and they, they want to Getting back to quality, legit. quality over quantity. Yeah. Yeah. What it, so what's it like over in Europe? I mean, is that, is it different or do you guys see those same it's, things? It same. pretty much becomes one. I mean, globalization is definitely making it more similar every day, I would say. Mm. Company wise, yeah. I mean, everyone here is having an iPhone as well, so yeah, there's that. <laughs> mm. Yeah, here too, and it's definitely it's it's definitely the same that things are not made to last longer than yeah. maybe a year or two, and it it's the same with you know any any kind of things like um, furniture and mm -hmm. home electronics on oh whatever. man. When we were looking That's just for it. people don't want to spend that much money. It's they true. rather spend little amounts of money regularly. So well, that's they why buy they go new, to like IKEA or whatever every two years. Yeah, that's why they go to like IKEA where years. everything is made out of particle board and stuff. But exactly. it looks nice. It's cheapish. It's all about the money that you spend at that moment. Yeah. It doesn't matter if you have to mm. spend more in the yeah. future to get the same yeah. thing again or whatever. Yeah. It's interesting. Yeah. 
Oh, man. I saw a Reddit post, actually, that was just saying, what brands have you noticed have, that have degraded? I saw that too, actually. Yeah, and it was interesting. Like, there were a lot of different ones listed, but lots of agreement about it, too. Of just, like... What, what was it? Uh, like, which brands of things have you noticed that have degraded in quality over the years? Mm. And there was, like, a lot of different ones. Mainly ones that were, like, appliance-based, like washer, washers and dryers and... Yeah, right. yeah. Things like that. Well, that automobiles just are a big one now too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like you don't see yes. you don't see people driving around in a nineteen ninety Ford Mustang, like mm -hmm. <laughs> going, Look at this classic car. It's yeah. just holding up like a beauty. Like mm -hmm. no, it mm -hmm. fell apart five years ago. Yeah. And it doesn't run anymore. Yeah, it's people true. We're driving nineteen fifty Cadillacs. My yeah, first ninety car nineties cars were not the best. Yeah. My first car and I don't think the newer ones are any better, probably. They will probably. all the electronics, they just degrade after a while. Mm -hmm. My first car was a nineteen eighty seven Volvo sedan. I can't remember a G something. But it was like it was so goofy, but it lasted so well. And the thing has like a steel frame. So yeah. it just felt <laughs> safer than right. <laughs> a lot of the kind of not so sturdy cars that they have today. Well, but they are lighter. That yeah. helps with the yeah. fuel consumption. It's true. It's true. And environment and everything. This is so why it's, we it's all just get Teslas. Ta -da. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I saw somebody driving a Tesla the other day. I've seen a couple of them mm -hmm. around. I haven't seen. There's quite a lot, lot of them in Austin. I don't think they are in Europe yet because they? they actually have like Tesla stores here. We got to go in it and like, oh, it was so fancy. Wow. I live a in a fan. very. I'm not saying this to brag because I am not part of this demographic, but I live in a very <laughs> rich part of the country, <laughs> <laughs> and so there's a lot of really nice cars. That just Did you hear drive that? Around. Full trans loaded. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's why I live in a two bedroom apartment. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm loaded. So you keep your money. <laughs> <laughs> Spend it wisely. Yeah. No, I think it's it's crazy. Those cars are ridiculous. Although I heard I heard that um, uh, what's the guy's name? Elon Musk or whatever. Mm -hmm. He was like he was really disappointed in everybody because they he, he upgraded the firmware or something or not him personally but mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, they upgraded the firmware in the car to be able to drive itself yeah the, down the freeway yep, yep. so it's like mm -hmm. it's not just cruise control but it's also you know yes mm -hmm. map there are tons of videos along. of that online already yep and people like the are first just, autopilot basically yeah but people are like not using it correctly. They're like using yes. it while they're in traffic and stuff and like <laughs> yeah. almost dying. Yeah. And, and then they like, blame the company stop. though. They're oh, like, yeah. this isn't safe. See, we can't have self-driving cars. It's going to kill yeah. people. Like, no. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's not what's supposed to be. It's so. the people being people stupid, not using it right. Exactly. Right? I, I saw a stat. This is kind of old, maybe a year old, so I don't know if it's still true, but I heard that any accident that a self-driving car, and I think they were talking specifically about Google, mm -hmm. any self-driving mm -hmm. car that was in an accident was caused by somebody, by yes. another car with yes. a human driver yeah. in it. Yeah, I heard that too. <laughs> it's like, wow. Well, and a lot of people that, are against it because they first they don't like giving up their freedom to drive. Right. And then secondly, they just don't trust the technology, but... Give it, give they them a couple of years yeah. and it will be standard. Well, part of it is just like they don't. I don't think they think about the fact that like those sensors in that car are going to every time, every time, be able to respond mm -hmm. faster than like yeah. a person. If they can. don't get tired. They don't. Yeah, they get don't. And, distracted. Nothing like that. Yeah. I mean, there's. I've thought about this. Like it, it baffles me that the human race as a whole is allowed to drive vehicles down roads at yes. 75 miles yes. an hour. Yes. <laughs> no, like, it just sounds well, so crazy. Like, over yeah, in Fave, we were talking about this, weren't we? Because then you were talking about there's no speed yeah. limit on the Audubon. So I don't... Yes. Yeah. Well, at least at some places. There are some speed limits, but mostly there's So no people go limit. insanely fast. Like, it just... It's crazy. Yeah. I can't believe it. I'm actually a very nervous driver. I, I avoid driving when I can because... If I feel like this huge weight of responsibility. <laughs> and uh, It's just a matter just, of getting used to, I think. Yeah, I, well, I mean, I was, for the longest time, mm -hmm. was very afraid to, but mm -hmm. once you get used to your car and to the road... Yeah, and you know well, and doing. it's not like I... Like, I don't think I'm a bad driver by any means. I think I'm a pretty decent driver. But I just don't like the stress of other people's unpredictableness. 
I think. Yeah. Especially like now that we're in Austin in a city. <laughs> holy crap, I can see why they do so many uh, ads against texting while driving because I see it all the time. Mm-hmm. And it's crazy. There's a sign in Nashville on I-65 and it's like an LED sign mm-hmm. that tells you how many people have died on that freeway th- that year. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, awesome. okay, I will... Uh, That's a wake-up call. Safe. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but for some reason, th- despite not having a speed limit, I think we still have less uh, casualties... Um, yeah. By car accident, then the then well, um, you got to see it in a fraction because of course the U.S. has a lot more people yeah. than Germany right. has, but yeah. the, the ratio is still better. What at what age can you guys drive in Finland 18. and Germany? Eighteen. Eighteen. It's Europe okay. completely. See here, I wow. could get a permit and drive when I was fourteen. Oh my god! Oh. I think at it's, least yeah, in it's my state, state here, in my state it was, and then yeah. fourteen you had to have an adult with you. In the seat next to you, but then after that, once you hit 16, you could drive by yourself. Yeah, you um, can, with an adult, you can, at least in Germany, at 17. Yeah. So, that's a thing. Wow. Because I feel like that might be part of it. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, maybe. 16-year-olds, 16, 16 yeah, I can and see 15. that they are not quite ready There's to drive certain, cars. There's certain, like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thought processes that maybe. I mean, they are like high school, and I, I don't, I don't. <laughs> know. Oh my gosh, the things that were going through my mind when I was fourteen had nothing to do with being safe on the road. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. <I> cannot imagine <laughs> yeah. having that responsibility at that age. I remember whenever yeah. two thousand fourteen hit, uh, it was just like <gasps> people who were born in two thousand are driving like <laughs> and that just like wow. made me feel really yeah. old all of a sudden uh yeah you are not even old in a <laughs> yeah yeah i'm not that old but i don't know i'm closer to 30 now than i am to 20 and that feels weird mm. yeah i know the feeling mm-hmm. i mean it's not bad i feel like the older i get the younger i feel like <laughs> I'm like, you know, yeah. all my 30-year-old friends, I'm like, oh, 30 is not that old. Whereas, like, when I was a kid, I thought 30 <laughs> was, like, the end, you know? Like, you turn 30, right. okay, you're basically dead, you know? <laughs> right. <laughs> basically dead, life yeah. over. Nothing yeah, it's only do downhill anymore. from there, so. <laughs> you yeah. might as well just give up. Time to make a will If you and haven't start fulfilled your, your dreams at 30, then you're yeah. done. You know? <laughs> it's just not going to happen. <laughs> But now I'm I'm much more optimistic about 30. Maybe because I just don't want to think that way anymore. <laughs> I I would say that 30 has been like as far as just like figuring myself out and like trying to understand humanity, like 30 has been like yeah. the best cuz I think there's something that happens mentally, or at least it did with me, where you're just like, I'm done with yeah. the crap. <laughs> yeah. I just want to know like reality and kindness and things that are long lasting. Like I'm done yeah. with the like the constant striving for mm-hmm. popularity and things Is that are Is it just like, you care moment. about what other people think have, a lot less? Yeah, like I definitely noticed that. Like I noticed myself being myself more. Like I started reading comic <laughs> books. I Nerd. started taking my YouTube channel <laughs> really seriously. I know, right? Like I for the longest time I would not touch a comic book because I'm like, I am not getting that on my name. Like, there's no way. <laughs> wow. And then like and then I hit 30 and this guy that I work with, he's a huge comic book nerd. And I was like, so tell me about these comic books. <laughs> he's, just like, he's like, what do you want to know? So he got, yeah, into, I got, he got me into like the Batman new 52 stuff. And I started reading a bunch of like Frank Miller comics and stuff like that. And just getting way into it. And like, now it's just kind of like a part of like, it's not a huge part of my life, but it's like, I, I enjoy it, you know? Mm-hmm. And I don't really, I don't care who knows it. So. <laughs> you even said it in a video. Wow. <laughs> it's like hi my name is Voltron and I read I'll comics I'll go over to Voltron's channel and judge yeah yeah. you can go judge him <laughs> leave all the comments comics are for nerds and he won't even care yeah there you go he won't even care he won't care so you can just leave the comments yeah so it's <laughs> yeah, fine I don't, I don't give a crap I'll just bullying is channel. fine if they don't care <laughs> right <laughs> okay that's not true at all okay that, that is not <laughs> here. Anasia said no I did not that was babe 
<laughs> was, what? I didn't say anything. <laughs> it was Mara. Listen to her cackle. I hear it. <laughs> <laughs> see? I told yeah, you. See. I'm, just, I'm just listening to mining here. Guys. <laughs> Mara, what are your thoughts on finding yourself and being... I, I agree with Fulton, actually. I feel like um, when I... When I'm not going to tell how old I am, but anyway, <laughs> <laughs> when when I uh, became closer to thirty mm -hmm. and went past it, <laughs> I, I I definitely feel like I started to um, know myself better. Mm -hmm. You know, know know who I am, know what I want, and all that. So mm -hmm. I agree with Fultron. Mm -hmm. I agree so with you too. What you're saying is that I'm the only one who hasn't found himself here yet. No. <laughs> <laughs> figured Good myself luck. out Good yet luck. i'm just okay I, no. no you I still have like a couple of yeah, years yeah i got four years to figure it out so i definitely I have, have not like figured myself out oh man but like it's not so much figuring yourself out but just being okay with the fact that you never will yeah like, yeah i think that's it okay. being content with you know? not yeah. with with yourself <laughs> yeah as just you are like, okay here's where i'm at right now I've got this thing in my life, which is really cool, but I've got this thing in my life, which really sucks. And that's just the way it is right now. Mm -hmm. And I'm a 30 year old grown adult man and I can handle it. That's it. Mm -hmm. And I feel like whenever so. I talk to younger people now though, like there's so many people, I don't know, teens to like early twenties are just hard. They're just hard. Mm -hmm. And yep. I get so <laughs> many younger people that are in that age group who are just like, you know, they just want to give up. You know, they're just tired. They don't yeah. think it'll get better. Mm. Yeah. And the thing I always want to say is just like, no, trust me, like <laughs> it gets so much better. And like, yeah. oh, your life changes. Yeah. It can change so dramatically in such a short amount of time. Mm. Yeah. So you'll suddenly be in a new environment where you can actually you know, take some time to figure yourself out. And I think now more than ever, the world is way more accepting of different social statuses and like true, interests and true. stuff like that. Well, kind of like it's, I feel like yeah, it's split, sure. like at least definitely like in the Internet community. I feel like it's that way. Yeah. I feel like and maybe it's just older generations to some extent who aren't connected with other people and other places. I feel like there are still mm -hmm. those kind of... Uh, What's the word? Mm. I can't, like, stereotypes, but I can't think of the word. <laughs> Something like that. But that, like, among, especially, like, younger-ish generations, that it's definitely opening up. The yeah. more people get connected, especially via online sources. Mm -hmm. I guess it depends very much if people are, like, online a lot or if they are not. Mm -hmm. Because, like, I, actually, I was yesterday, I was on a, a birthday party of a friend. Yeah. And uh, he's what I think he's how old is he? He's like a couple of years older than me. Okay. So so he's like probably 50? at toward thirty, also. <laughs> no, not thirty kidding. yet, but like <laughs> yeah, sorry. Not <laughs> and yeah. uh, he had some friends, and they came from like they were from Bavaria, and Bavaria is the part of Germany which is like the the most conservative mm. i guess you can say mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i mean there are of course a lot of people that are open for everything like everywhere but especially the older folks here is just um very very conservative still and i, I really felt out of place talking to some of these people yesterday i just like i totally couldn't couldn't mm. i just couldn't and i, yeah. I don't know, it was an interesting experience for me mm -hmm. once more to see that so there are still these people, even kind of in our age group, that are not as open for everything yet. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's true. <clears throat> and we've gone way past our time, but I feel like this is such a good conversation. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, yeah, only, I started recording right at the beginning. It's only 22 oh, minutes. Oh, okay. Well, we're doing yeah. good. It's not that we got another 40 minutes then for this podcast. <laughs> 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 podcast yes, about humanity. You, please. <laughs> <laughs> We have a, such a deep discussion. It is here. a deep discussion. It's a good one. It is. Yeah. That's like last time my full mind. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I think. Oh, this time we are not talking about lashes. Yeah, that's true. No lash, <laughs> lash discussion. <laughs> no more lashes. I had one other thing I wanted to say that, like, I I think part of it too is as you get a little bit older, you start to realize that it's okay to choose who you like, who you be friends with, or who you want to be friends with, mm -hmm. like. I feel like as a younger person, 
I felt like I had to be friends with everyone and I wanted to be known by everyone and liked by everyone. Mm -hmm. And it's not like that's really changed, but my priorities on who I surround myself with is different. And like, Mm -hmm. I feel like it's okay to, I don't know how to word that, but like to choose which friendships you really want to invest in and kind of avoid toxic people and stuff like that. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like well, I, think more. I said it in a vlog once that like you're born with like a, a certain like a limited amount of cares you can get. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and so like as you get older you start to hold them a little closer yeah. and you only give them out to things that really you're like, matter. Like man I've already given away so <laughs> many. That is awesome. Yeah. I like and that. friendships that are one of those really things cool. where it's like I don't have enough cares to give you. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. It's so true though. <laughs> it's so true. And it's not like you mean any ill will towards those people or no. anything like that. You wish them well but you just can't pour so much of yourself into them and yeah right. yeah that is actually very good i just uh, lost diamond into lava oh <laughs> sad day. What? i found so many diamonds again today it's crazy man yeah i found quite a few i found yeah, yeah I, found I found and we were next to each other i found a lot yeah wow i didn't find i found eight i found I well eight, eight eight diamonds oh i don't uh, have that many four. <laughs> well, I just have the blocks, so I don't know. I don't know how many. Oh, okay. I have, actually. no, I already yeah, have. Yeah, yeah. Well, I have, yeah, I have, I have all blocks too. Well, that's probably more than thirty. Maybe just a little bit. I got seventeen. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Seventeen diamonds or seventeen blocks? Diamonds. <laughs> oh, okay. I don't okay, have so iron yeah, bars. Do we want to end this? I'm coming. Yeah, I probably my should. Matter. No, not my last one. <laughs> If only Edson were on. No, just kidding. Hunt him down. <laughs> yep. Well, thank you guys for joining us on this super deep mindless mining mm-hmm. episode. <laughs> yeah, Share your watch, thoughts you about humanity. <laughs> Takeaways from today. It gets better. It gets better, sort of. Okay, see you next year. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next Bye. time. Bye. Bye. Bye.